Today, I'll show you how to replace a key on a laptop. Let's start with removing the key. Gently lift the key from either top corner, one corner at a time. Then, you can detach the bottom corners carefully until it snaps off. Don't lift the top corners while pulling out the bottom corners, or you may damage the key. Putting the key back is easy, just press it back into place with your finger. If you apply too much force, the small plastic tabs on the underside of the key may bend. In that case, the key won't stay in place. To remove the hinge, you'll need a thin tip tool, like tweezers or a screwdriver. Gently push the foot at the upper corner of the hinge out of the hook. Detach both upper corners separately. At this stage, the hinge can easily break if you're not careful. Try to place the hinge in the same orientation when reinstalling it. Otherwise, it might easily be installed upside down, and the key won't grip onto it. Install the hinge by first placing the bottom hooks and then pressing the upper hooks into place individually. Test by lifting the edges to make sure you installed the hinge correctly, otherwise, the key won't attach to it. If the hinge is undamaged and you have an intact key, it should easily attach by pressing it with your finger. Hinge damage is easily noticeable typically breaking in the middle of the plastic peg. In such cases, you'll need to order a replacement part, perhaps from eBay or a Chinese store. Note that even if hinges look similar, they are usually not compatible between different device models. However, damage to the key's tabs may sometimes go unnoticed, the key just won't grip, and it needs to be replaced. In this case, you can see that the tab is clearly bent, and the key is unusable. This key can't be reattached, and a new one must be obtained. Initially, installing and removing the hinge can be challenging, but with practice and using the right tool, it becomes smoother. It's advisable to practice first on an old, broken device if possible. Be cautious not to use too much force, and remember to lift from the top corner first. Occasionally, the hinge may still break. Key removal, however, involves a small risk, and the plastic may break if the key is repeatedly pulled off. Thank you for watching, I hope the video was helpful for you.